Hi everybody, welcome to Live Blogger. In this video, I'll show you how to add this code editor to your blogger website. So here we can see we have this code editor displayed over here and we are using a library called ASJS for this. So if I just type some code over here, so if I just type const and if I just type heading equals document dot query selector. Here we can see that we have set the language of this code editor to JavaScript. And so we have the syntax highlighting of JavaScript in this code editor. Now you can set the language to anything you want and you can also change the theme of this code editor. Now if you want to learn how we have designed this then you can watch my previous video. I have shown you how to design this using the ASJS library. Now in this video we're going to add this code editor to our blogger website. So let's get started. <laughs> Right here I'm in the dashboard of my blogger website so we can add this inside a post or a page. Let's add it inside a post. So let's click on new post and uh, for the title I just type code editor. And the first thing you have to do is go into the HTML view. So click on this button and click on HTML view. Now here you have to add the HTML, the CSS and the JavaScript. So first of all let's add the CSS. I'll just create a style tag. And now let's go to the source code. And I will leave the link of the source code in the description. Alright, so let's go to the style.css file and let's copy all this CSS from here. And let's paste it inside this style tag. Alright, the next thing we will do is add the HTML. So outside this style tag, let's add the HTML. So let's go to the index.html file and let's copy everything inside the body. And let's paste it over here. And the last thing we need to do is add the JavaScript. So let's create a script tag. And let's go back to our source code. And let's copy all this JavaScript from here. And let's paste it over here. Now here we can add some options to the editor. So here we can see there are two options, theme and mode. So the theme is the theme of this code editor right here. And the mode is the language. So you can change this language to whatever you want. And you can also change the theme. So if you go to the home page of ASJS and if I click on how to and if you scroll down we can see that we have this link called see all themes. So if I click on that all the themes are displayed over here and you can just go ahead and copy and paste this theme name and just paste it over here instead of this name right here. And then in the HTML you have this heading and this text and all these things over here. You can change these to whatever you want. And if you scroll up, all the CSS of the code editor are displayed over here. Right now, let's click on publish and let's see whether it works. And confirm. Right now, let's click on view. And we can see that the code editor is displayed over here. And you can start writing the code over here. But uh, we can see that the width of the code editor is a little bit too much. So let's go back to our post. And let's make some changes in the CSS. So here for the editor container, I just set the width to 100% of the parent and let's see how it looks now. Let's go back to the post and let's refresh this page. And now we can see we have the correct width for the code editor. So that's basically how you can add a code editor to your blogger website. Now if you want to learn how we wrote all this code over here, then you can watch my previous video. I will leave the link in the description of this video and I will also leave the link of the source code so you can just copy and paste the code to your websites. Alright, so that's it for this video. If you have any doubts, you can ask in the comments below. And if you like this video, please click on the like button and subscribe to this channel to get the latest video updates. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a nice day.